Chapter 16, Your Hearing Day In this chapter, you will learn what happens on your hearing day. This is the final chapter in the series. You must go to the court hearing unless the court tells you that you do not need to attend. Remember that some cases do not require an appearance. Be sure to ask the court whether or not an appearance is required. Make sure to arrive at the courthouse early so you have enough time to find parking, go through weapon screening, and find the correct courtroom. If you are late, your hearing may be canceled or your case may be dismissed. Make sure to check in with the clerk in the courtroom if necessary. If you are not sure if you need to check in, ask court staff. When you are in the courtroom, listen for your case to be called. There may be other cases scheduled for a hearing at the same time. When your case is called, follow the directions of the judge or the clerk. If you prepared any outliner notes, you can have them with you. The judge may ask you questions about your case, so be prepared to respond. Some of the parties that you served may also appear at your hearing. The judge may allow those parties to discuss their position on your expungement. Be prepared to listen to this at the hearing. The judge may tell you of their decision at the hearing, or, more likely, the judge may tell you that they are taking the matter under advisement and that you will receive a written decision called an order in the mail. Taking the matter under advisement means that the judge is going to review the information and take some time to think about the case and then put their decision in writing. Be aware that if the case is taken under advisement, the judge has up to 90 days to issue their decision, but it may not take that long. If the judge grants your expungement petition, any records ordered to be sealed will not be sealed until 60 days after the date listed on the judge's order. This is because the case is held open for either party to file an appeal. Be aware that the judge could order all records sealed, including records from other agencies, or order only court records to be sealed. The judge could also deny your request. If the order only seals court records, employers and others may still find out about the offense by looking at the records of the other agencies, such as the BCA. Make sure to read your order carefully so you know exactly what it covers. If your request is denied, get legal advice. There are time limitations on when you have to appeal, so it is a good idea to seek advice as soon as possible. If you have more questions about criminal expungement that were not covered in this video, or for more information on any other court-related matter, contact the Statewide Self-Help Center. Call us at the number on the screen or visit our website to submit a question by email.